Doug Aldrich. It's been really great to be here with you at the Guitar Tutorials World Music Studio Guitar Sauce. And uh, this is the last lick I'm going to do for today. I, or, I mean, there's so many things I would love to show you, but I'm going to ju just picking a few things, warm-ups and some staccato, legato things. And then this is my favorite key to play in is G, because then you get the open G strings. And um, there's been some licks that I had done online before d different... <laughs> That kind of that kind of staccato stuff, and it is really cool. What's cool about it is because you're using the open strings. Even just that right there. So that one right there, let's start on the let's start on the, the fifth fret on the A string. I'm just pedaling off of the open G. Pentatonic licks incorporated with the open strings are really nice. You can stay pentatonic just doing. But sometimes throwing in that open string makes it special. It was open. Um, but that, that staccato thing. Uh, starting on the the um, fifth fret on the D string, Just skipping down to the G string. You can you can you can morph it into uh, diatonic. Just kind of morphed it into, from G minor into D major. favorite key for all you know all this um, up to that position it's a high bend on the on the upper G pentatonic um, so anyway I hope that you learned some things as there were some things that sprout some ideas. Um, and 
in any key, really, you can use the open strings. I mean, sometimes even in A or uh, whatever it works out. If you're playing in B, for example. <laughs> So using open strings in B or in A. Just experiment with it and have fun with it. Um, and hope you hope you uh, enjoyed this. I did. Thank you so much. And uh, thanks to everybody at Guitar Tutorials and World Music Studios here in Milano and Guitar Sauce. Everybody needs Guitar Sauce. Thanks, guys.